Let's carve some tiki's, shall we? Some crazy wood. I don't know what kind it is. It might be maybe that kind. The woods know what kind of wood this is. Comment down below. I'm really not sure. And that's where we're going to be chopping his head off. Or her. I really like the form of this beautiful specimen. It's got a big ol' schnoz. And it's got a lot of character. Naturally. So, I got really lucky because someone was chopping a whole bunch of wood randomly and left a whole lot behind. So I picked it all up. There are bugs up in it, and it was just, ugh. So I did treat it with some pesticides. Let it sit overnight, and let it dry out in the sun for a little bit. It seems to be okay. So I'm using an angle grinder to remove all the bark before we start to do our carving. That looks like a toilet. So enjoy this time lapse. This is probably the most important part of my debarking, there's uh, some interesting discoveries I've made. I'm really trying to remove anything that's going to compromise the integrity of this wood or potentially cause any kind of rot or attract any other kind of disgusting insects. Um, there's this fleshy, loose part of the bark and when I peel it off, it was a surprise to say the least. Yep, dank moist bark. It's a thing. Man, was it gross. I mean, the smell was nothing I've ever smelled before. It was different. Yeah, different. So on a more positive note, vlog, 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 vlog. Not only was that dank bark nasty, you wouldn't be able to carve anything really through that. So that's pretty much the majority of what I removed. Look at that face. What a great face. You got a great face. I love it. Ah, it's gonna make it just too easy. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, okay. You pick a toy. I bet he's gonna want a log. He's gonna want a log. I knew it! Yes, log. Yes, log indeed. Thanks for watching, everybody. And stay tuned for the next episode, the next part to our Dead Idol wood carving. I'm gonna log off before I make any more log puns. <laughs>